you know, I look back every once in a while my great grandfather, what he would think. And he was a, such a practical guy. His attitude always was, you do the best, the best will happen. And I think that's what's happening. I think he would think this was all great, and he would, and he'd be proud of it, he would, but he'd be much more interested in being on the factory floor. And that's the truth. It's a great tradition to carry on and legacy to carry on. The only toys I ever got to play with are those little caterpillar toys, you know, way back when, 1948 is when I was born in Peoria, Illinois. My father was working for Caterpillar at the time. And, uh, and uh, but my fondest memories are when I first started. I mean, there's no doubt about it. I was a kid and, you know, I, I started as a parts runner and started all that stuff. And then I remember my first job outside of the wash rack and I burned up the rubber boots because I left them on the steam cleaner, you know, those kinds of things. I remember uh, these guys, I started working as an assistant for the field service guys, which I just loved that because we were out all day, every day, working hard and on your own and all that kind of stuff. And, you know, they just razzed me. Remember, I was the boss's son. I mean, every day. And, uh, you know, I remember one day being taken out into a, uh, into a landfill. Back then we called them garbage dumps. Remember, now they're landfills. And this is in Corpus Christi, Texas, 110 degrees, 100% humidity. And they tell me I got to do something under the belly pan. Well, of course, it wasn't clean. So I crawl through the garbage all the way back to the back end, and they're all standing around the back end laughing, of course, because I'm now covered with garbage. So those are the kinds of memories you have. And it has to do with the people, you know? I mean, yes, I love the machinery, and I, I love the machinery. I love being in the machinery business of all levels. Engines, luckily, we were in a territory from day one that big on engines, shrimp boat engines, oil field engines, you know. But the machinery and all of it goes together. So for me, it, but it still was the people. I mean, I just love our customer base. I love the people that like this type of business and want to be in it. And luckily, Caterpillar Inc., Caterpillar Tractor Company, when it was merged in 1925, now Caterpillar Inc., has carried on that tradition using the same innovative ways of operating, the same focus on character and ethics, become truly a worldwide company in a very strong way on a, on a global basis.